Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Thursday, 16th of February 2023. These trades were shared by HS, who's trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD using a Forex broker. The macro chart shows that the price reached a support level, got rejected, and we can see the breakout of the uh, downtrend channel at this point. So this uptrend channel was identified in the trading chart. This was the uptrend channel in the trading chart and all pullbacks were taken using ALGO 125. And as you see, all these trades reached profit target using exit strategy number one. So thank you HS for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by SH who is trading Euro USD and you see one minute trading chart. This was the pullback on the trading chart that got completed. He entered right position at the right location based on ALGO 1 to 5, an entry signal and is now uh, set the target and a stop loss properly and is waiting for the trade and managing that proactively and just reached the target. So thank you SH for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Castro, our global instructor, and as you see here, he's trading micro YM, which is the futures of the Dow Jones Industrial Average micro contracts. Two positions were open in this downtrend uh, channel, and you see here the trading chart is going down, and the same positions were taken as a CFD using a Forex broker. So both trades are managed and reaching a target with very good risk to reward ratio. And this is also the same instrument and you see now the five minute charts and this runner was hold and you see it's getting close to its target. So thank you Castro for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Sam, or global instructor from Australia, who is trading gold in form of CFD using Forex broker. This downtrend channel was identified and shorted here that you see entry and exits here properly uh, using one minute trading chart. The entry and exit is here clear. And also when the price went down all the way and tested the support level and got rejected, and a new pullback was formed. He entered here and exit with profit. So thank you, Sam, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken and the video was sent with the detailed explanation to students yesterday. So I'm gonna replay the video for you. Hello, everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that I have taken at the beginning of New York market session on Thursday, 16th of February, 2023. The market, as you see, the one hour macro shows that after several uh, news at 8.30, dropped significantly and retested the level uh, that was previous point of control and also previous uh, low of the day. And uh, as you see, it was around 12,500 here. The shadow that you see here uh, is this. 9.30, so let's look at five minute charts. This level was tested and got rejected uh, very nicely and the buyers came back. So you see the order flow of buyers. So I waited for this candle of five minutes to be completed and then took long position on this uptrend channels, which you can see it here, was going up and that can be seen as a clear channel in our 10 second trading chart. So this level here, this channel here, and also took long position uh, beside NASDAQ and micro NASDAQ on Russell because Russell also dropped and retested this level of previous uh, point of control and got rejected here, the price. And it was very nicely trendy on, you can see it on here, 10 second chart which is my trading chart. So this was a trading channel on my trading chart of Russell. That was traded and you can see entries and exits here. 
So the result of each uh, trade was copied to multiple Apex trading accounts, and uh, it shows that the, on average the profit factor was 99, and it's for, it cannot be calculated because the win rate was almost 100%, and average win to loss ratio was 11, and the largest winning trade was $300, and largest losing trade was $7. So hope this trade taken by the PAT system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.